Over the last few years, the residents of the city of La Coruña have laid the foundations for the creation of a space in which to live, a future in which everyone has a part to play. previously been subjected to a kind of urban anarchy and had suffered the effects of shortfalls in educational and cultural offers, a lack of social and cultural motivation and practically non-existent urban and economic planning. Added to this, there were a number of impoverished quarters on the outskirts of the city which were focal points for the more marginalized sectors of society. The city of La Coruña was situated a long way from anywhere, and the future looked bleak. After this grim outlook, the government decided that its prime objective would be to create the infrastructures and services that were clearly lacking in the city, whilst at the same time setting up a framework for modern urban planning throughout in human terms, designed for and by the residents themselves. The recovery of the coastline is an achievement whose importance extends far beyond the improvement of the city's landscape. La Coruña was formerly built on a peninsula surrounded by the sea on three sides, yet access for its inhabitants was severely restricted. Winning back the Atlantic and cleaning up the city's beaches and coves has revolutionized the lives of the people of La Coruña. Their enjoyment of the ocean has opened up their lungs and their eyes, broadening the horizons of all. been the creation and opening of parks, green areas and leisure zones, including large areas with integral services and smaller areas which make the city more human. The urban planning strategy has managed to integrate the outskirts into the city, rehousing families and eliminating the more marginalized zones with strategic plans aimed at generating employment and creating a sense of vitality in all the quarters of La Coruña and preventing situations of social exclusion. to be shared by all, recovering, restoring and preserving the treasures that have been handed down to each and every resident. New spaces for education and learning have also been created, including the first museum in the world dedicated to the study of the human being. The Science Museum, the Finisterre Aquarium, museums based on innovative concepts where touching, feeling, understanding and learning all form part of the experience poles of attraction that have become points of reference on the educational map.
the Opera House is home to Galicia's Symphonic Orchestra, funded by La Coruña City Council. La Coruña is creating the perfect setting for learning, listening, seeing and enjoying. These proposals are open to residents and visitors alike. A Congress city, a city worth visiting is in the process of being created, acting as a dynamic boost to a wide range of sectors in the local economy. A city that knows that a good education is its finest asset for the future. La Coruña has been the driving force behind a brand new integral concept for the treatment of waste in our country. Its decision to implement selective waste collection procedures is a clear commitment to the promotion of resident collaboration. The sustainability of this system depends to a large extent on each family, business and individual. The results have been a complete success. Thanks to the commitment made by all, La Coruña has created the Iberian Peninsula's first recycling, compost, cogeneration and treatment plant. Care with the water cycle, cleaning, energy savings, the fight against environmental, air and light pollution and good urban practices are daily commitments that have a direct impact on the quality of life in the city. Raising residents' collective awareness is another vital stage in this process. The Coruña Millennium Network is the synergy of all these structures, institutions, organizations and individuals that share responsibility in La Coruña for the fight against social exclusion and the promotion of residents' involvement and collaboration in social, cultural and economic activities. This is a network of networks where information and shared efforts are united in a common goal, that of offering the people improved services. Being in touch with residents, direct contact and a rapid response to minor problems all form one way of going about things. A philosophy based on serving the community by encouraging their active involvement. Civic centers have been set up throughout the city to organize activities designed for all ages and which have proved extremely popular among residents. The La Coruña of the third millennium is gradually taking shape. Improvements in communications and above all our own efforts have made this city a place to live in. A city for the future, with a present that is here and now.